light up? Like, what is this thing? Quality? I'd probably give it a nine. I really like Culver's chicken. <laughs> it also does not look appetizing in the slightest. But packaging, 10 out of 10. Really like. Definitely not on the same level as Burger King. Oh my gosh. Hi guys, it's Audrey. And today I am going to be driving to seven. This is two. Seven fast food places and trying the kids menu on all of them so you guys don't have to. Unless you're a kid, then you probably already ordered kids menu. But anyways, I'm gonna be testing from seven different fast food places around me and seeing what fast food place offers the best kids menu meal. Um, usually I order just like the normal meals from all these places, but I thought it'd be fun to see like how they differ from each other and like what they offer and stuff. So anyways, we're about to, I mean, I'm in the car right now. We're about to drive there and I'll show a little clips of me getting them. And then we're gonna bring all the food back to my apartment and then try it. And guys, you better bet I'm probably gonna be eating all of these because I'm guessing that the kids menu um, doesn't have a lot of food. Like it probably has like five fries <laughs> and a small burger or like nuggets or something. So it's like three o'clock. I haven't eaten lunch yet. so I'm super hungry and ready to eat. But yeah, let's drive these places and get the foods. Okay guys, I just went through the first stop, which was Del Taco, and it was so fast. Like I was planning on recording them giving me the food, but like there was no line at all and I just got it. So here it is. It was only three bucks, so pretty cheap. I'm excited to try it, but I have to wait till I get home. So we're gonna go to the next stop. And I think the next one's gonna be Arctic Circle. I don't know if you can tell. You, put, you can't see it. Um, I wasn't planning on going here, but it's just right, like, like I'm literally right in front of it. It's by the Del Taco. So we're gonna go there and try the food. All right, guys, I'm in the drive-thru of Culver's right now. It was so hard getting here. I don't know why it was a struggle bus for me, but I got the tiny, cute little meal um, from the last place. It was expensive though, it was like five bucks, which is kind of a rip off, because that's like a normal meal like price. Um, I'm gonna order Culver's, and then we're gonna go through the other places. They probably won't show me going through them because it's gonna be like the same thing. I'm just gonna collect more and more bags, but I'll catch you when I'm back in my apartment testing everything out. All right, guys, I am back, and I have all of my fast foods here with me. So I'll tell you what I got. We have Arby's. We have Arby's right here. We have, I think this is Carl's Jr. And we have McDonald's, of course. This is like the classic. Um, Arctic Circle, Burger King, uh, Culver's, and what? Del Taco. So these are all the ones that we are gonna be testing out today. But there are many more fast food places, so if you do want a part two, leave in the comments down below. Guys, I am so sad I was not able to try Chick-fil-A's kid meal in this video because Chick-fil-A in our area is closed because it's reconstructing, so I couldn't go there today. But if we do a part two, I will definitely go there. But anyways, I think we should start. And I have all the drinks off to the side as well. And I think I'll go in the order from what like I got. So we're gonna start off with some Del Taco. All right, so here's the Del Taco meal. We have a clear cup. I think Del Taco was actually the only one that came with a clear cup. This is a pretty good size for like a kid's meal. So. I approve of the drink. I think what I'm going to do is judge each one based off of aesthetics, like how it looks, come packaging and stuff, how the meal looks. Uh, I mean, I also judge it based upon like quantity, like how much do they give me for the kids meal and quality and how good it is. So aesthetics, I'd say it's pretty decent. This is like a standard uh, kids meal bag. Um, I like the cup though, so that's pretty solid. They gave me a giant straw, like a jumbo straw. I feel like this is like a smoothie straw. So we're gonna stick that in there. Mm, I got a Sprite. But from the kids menu, right, we got a taco and we got, let's see, what is this? Oh, the fries fell off the bag. We got some stickers. Oh, it's a maze. We have to complete the maze on this. I forget that kids' menus come with toys. Oh, these are from all the other places. <laughs> okay, well, all the fries fell out, so I guess I'll just stick the fries on here. That's way sad. I only asked for like one sauce, but they gave me a bunch of Taco Bell sauces. So I guess I'll just save the rest for later whenever we go to Del Taco. All right, so let's try 
the taco. Okay. Pretty good. Everything's a little cold because I had to go to a bunch of other places to get food. But the taco wasn't as crunchy or crunchy <laughs> as I thought it was gonna be. It's kind of like a very bendable taco. Whenever I eat fries, I also eat them with ranch because I'm weird and I love it. Fries are mediocre. It would be way more enjoyable with like a sauce, but they're okay. They're not gross, but they're not like my favorite fries. So for Del Taco, I probably rate it on a scale of one to 10. Hmm. Packaging, I'd probably give like five. It's normal. Quality, I'd probably give like, um, you know, for a kid's meal, like if I was a kid, this would be enough. So this is probably like a seven. And then quantity, also like probably an eight or a nine. One taco is enough to feed like a, like a kid, but like I usually get two or three tacos and I eat, so. All right, that's it for the first one. I'm definitely gonna be eating all these, but we have to keep moving on. So I'll come back to this later. Let's go to the next fast food. All right, the next place I went to was Arctic Circle. And guys, I would say that this is a pretty like eight out of 10 for packaging because they decorated for Halloween. I'm actually filming this the day before Halloween. So pretty cute. It reminds me of the McDonald's box because it's like a box instead of a bag, which is really nice. I actually like this way more than the bags because if it's in a car, it's less of a chance of spilling everywhere, which happens. But their cups are so small. Like if I compare this to the other one, I don't know, I just feel like in size, this one is very mini, but it's okay. So let's open it up and see what we got. We got a burger, we got some fries. Oh, and a little toy. So let's see what we got here. I, I think this is a Halloween toy, which is kind of fun. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Ooh, it's like a light up, like, what is this thing? I think this is a mummy. We got a light up mummy wand, so in the dark, you could just be like having a dance party. All right, winning my vote here. All right, let's try the fries. So these are just straight cut fries. They're not like wavy. Pretty good, I like. Not my favorite. All right, yes, I already see a pickle on this and I'm so excited, I love pickles. Pretty good, pretty good. For a kid's meal, like, I feel like this would be filling. Um, the fries, I feel like there's not a whole lot. Like, it comes in a tiny little container. So I feel like they could have given more fries. But you know, not bad. I like the burger. Overall, food quality, I'd probably rate it a six or seven. Quantity, um, probably like a five, it's average. But packaging, 10 out of 10, really like. Next one. <laughs> All right, the next place I went to was Culver's, and I actually didn't know what Culver's was until this year because I don't think I ever saw one before. So um, I've only been there once. Ooh, they also have wavy fries like Del Taco. Um, I think they're known for their like honey butter burgers, but of course me, I got the chicken tenders. <laughs> so we're gonna be judging their chicken. Oh, oh. So they actually did. They gave me ranch and fry sauce, which you guys, if you guys don't know, fry sauce is a dipping sauce for your fries. Um, it's a Utah thing. Like no one else outside of Utah knows what this is basically, but it's just like mayo and ketchup mixed together. That's the best I can explain it. Um, so I guess I'll be using the fry sauce because it's kind of fun. Let's be try it. Let's try the fries plain and then try it with the sauce. Plain. They're literally like these last ones. Like, they don't really, like literally, it's the same as Del Taco. They don't differ in the slightest. So fries, pretty good. Let's try this chicken. They only gave me two, because in the kitchen, there's only two. This is a pretty big piece of chicken though. Like I was just expecting like a little tiny one. Mmm, this is good. Okay, this actually tastes like real chicken. So, mm, this is really, really good. Okay, food quality, I'd probably give it a nine. I really like Culver's chicken. Um, Quantity, this is probably enough for a kid. Actually, maybe you need, depends on how old the kid is. You might want to get the four piece chicken nuggets. I don't know if there is one. So I'd probably say like an eight. And then, oh yeah, they gave me an apple juice. So that's kind of cute. Uh, packaging. Well, considering that I got a free scoop of ice cream, I'm keeping this and coming back. Uh, nine out of 10, I get ice cream plus you can look at these cute cow pics. So let's move on to the next one. <laughs> All right, next up I went to um, Carl's Jr. 
And this is what the packaging looks like. It looks like they were sponsored by Teen Titans. Kind of fun, kind of colorful. Probably rate it like a five star rating. But our toy, what is this? Oh, it's a Teen Titans thing. <laughs> All right, so what even, what am I even looking at? <laughs> I don't even know what this is. Okay, we come with little stickers here. And I guess this just stands. Oh, I think you're supposed to put the stickers on this and decorate it. This is like a one-time use toy. Not my favorite, but that's okay. Um, so we got some fries. These are the cut, straight cut fries. Ta-da. I feel like this is the size of a small fry when you order like a normal menu. Okay. <laughs> and we got the uh, star chicken nuggets. Which, I don't know why, but to me they look so artificial. Like, okay, doesn't this look like not real chicken to you? We'll try it, we'll try it. Here we go. Honestly, it kind of reminds me of Burger King and McDonald's in one. Here's inside. Like, it doesn't like, it looks like fast food chicken, you know? Like, it doesn't really look like the Culver's or Chick-fil-A chicken where it's like fast food, but like, it looks like real chicken. This just looks like your fast food processed chicken, which I don't know how it was made, and I don't even know if I want to know how it's made. So, I probably wait, well, I gotta try the fry first. I don't know, this is probably the worst fry I've had so far. I don't think I really like Carl's Jr. So, quality, probably like a four. Quantity, also probably like a four or five, because they only have four of these packaging. Probably a five, because I don't really care for Teen Titans. I didn't really like the toy, so. This one may be at the bottom of the list. All right, next up we have Arby's. And every time I go to Arby's, I have to get like the roast beef sandwich. So that's what we got in the kids meal version. Oh my gosh, I completely broke the top of this cup. I was trying to put in my straw. Oh my gosh, here I'll show you. Oh uh, yeah, see, I like, I totally broke this thing. All right, so uh, quality is not doing so hot. Good Sprite. Next, um, oh, okay, so instead of fries, they gave me some applesauce, health, health, and here's the burger, oh my gosh, this is puny, it also does not look appetizing in the slightest, this is so gross, I'm not sure about their kids I know, I love Arby's, but right now, this is really sketch, so, What's the little toy they gave me? Oh my gosh, everything's like sort of greasy. I don't know what this is, but I'm gonna break the toy. I don't know how to work this. Trash. All right, so you have to, if you go to Arby's, you have to like put the Arby sauce on the, the burger. Like there's no other way to eat it. The sauce is part of the meal. Oh my gosh, this like looks so gross. Okay, like for packaging, I'm gonna rate this like a one. It broke, it does not look good. And the toy doesn't make any sense, so this is the worst packaging so far. Basically, they just put like roast beef and Swiss in a biscuit, and that's it. I do not like their normal meals taste way different than their kids' meals, so I have to rate this one like a two or a three. I'm so sorry, Arby's. I really love Arby's, so this is strange, but I would not recommend. On um, quantity, also, this would not fill me up, so probably a two or three. That's so sad. <laughs> Let's move on to the next one. All right. The next place I went to was Burger King, and we have some Capri Sun apple juice. That was our drink that they gave us. And we got a burger, a cheeseburger, and some fries. And the toy that they gave us, let's see. All these are so interesting. Like, what in the world? You're supposed to put water in this? So I think what, I don't understand these. I don't know how like kids know what to do with these things. This is what it is though. I think what's telling me is to fill this up with water and then you spin this thing down here and just like water splurts out. This is a messy toy. Mm. I don't know what parent would want their kids playing with this, but okay, let's try their fries. Whoa, whoa. These are by far the saltiest fries out of all the ones we've tried so far. They're also like the normal fry shape. I'm not complaining because I like salty, but like compared to all the rest, if you do not, I, I don't recommend. All right, and then this is what their burger looks like. Kind of reminds me of McDonald's in a way, but. 
that was really easy to bite into but i feel like the beef is like artificial i don't know they have cheese it's just a cheeseburger with pickles on it but it does really remind me of mcdonald's and like my personal opinion mcdonald's is at the bottom of my fast food chain because i do not like mcdonald's uh only for like certain things i like their breakfast menu but like i wouldn't choose to go there um but i also really don't like burger king <laughs> we used to go there a lot but i kind of got sick of it it's an all right meal. I think packaging, I mean, it's classic. Like, they do a good job of branding, so probably like a six. Quality, probably like a four. Quantity, um, this is a good amount, so probably a seven. All right, lastly, we have the famous McDonald's. So, we got a Pepsi, I think, from there, because they were all out of Sprite and root beer. <laughs> So here's the little box, 10 out of 10 packaging because you know, it's just cute and like classic and so well branded. Like everyone knows McDonald's, everyone knows. <laughs> and from there we got four chicken McNuggets. They are so tiny, oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't know why, but like whenever I look at a McDonald's chicken nugget, it just looks like a rock. Like this doesn't, mm, I already know what the inside looks like too, like without even trying it because I've had this before. We got some fries and ooh, what in the world? Ooh, we got a marble ball. That's, that's probably the best one we've gotten here. Let's see what we got. We got Scarlet Witch. Ta-da! She like moves her arms. Pew pew, collect them all. So let's try their chicken nuggets. Okay, one time I saw this video of how chicken nuggets were made at McDonald's. Do not recommend. So that's all I can think of every time I eat one of these. But it's just white on the inside. It reminds me of the other chicken nuggets that we had, Carl's Jr. It just is like fake chicken. <laughs> and then the fries. I feel like McDonald's is known for their fries. And they're also a little bit more salty, but definitely not on the same level as Burger King. Oh my gosh. Quality, I'd probably rate like a five. Quantity, probably like also a five, because I feel like a lot of kids could eat more than this, but it's all right. So yeah. Anyways, guys, that's gonna be the end of today's video. I think my favorite was Culver's surprisingly even though I like had never really been there before it was super good I really love their chicken strips and my least favorite had to be Arby's which is so shocking because I love Arby's but the kids menu is not good so I, I do not recommend getting the kids menu if you go there just get a normal menu for your kid because gross <laughs> but anyways guys if you like this video give it a thumbs up comment down below what your favorite fast food place is and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys next time bye